The countdown to Christmas is ticking away. If you're dreading that extra dose of family time, you know <laughs> the holidays can be tough to deal with certain relatives around. And Val Baldwin is here to help us sort of navigate through yes, this. No worries. Uh, it's interesting because family, I mean, they're the people we love most. Of course. And yet somehow they can be the ones who drive us the most crazy. Why Absolutely. is that? Absolutely. That's just typical and normal. Uh, there are some people who can be a little more difficult, and that's all right. But the thing that we have to understand is that we can cannot change the other person but you can adjust your behavior so we can adapt we can adapt and it's all about showing love and respect and I've got five fabulous strategies I love it okay yes. let's jump in. Yes, number yes, yes. one you say plan ahead on what your relationship boundaries are what does that mean actually your conversation boundaries okay yes. okay so what are you going to feel comfortable okay with talking about so maybe this I mean is about politics your dialogue be, here exactly so let's say that you're not comfortable talking about politics you know, that can get really oh uh -huh. crazy That's or, if, or if there's other things that you're not feeling comfortable with if, if somebody starts into whatever that is and you don't feel comfortable you just say you know thanks thank you uncle john for for asking me my opinion on that but i just don't feel comfortable talking about politics but what i'd love to talk to you about is oh my gosh i found this new restaurant on main street downtown it's incredible so you what you do is just, you just kind of deflect you skirt it a little to bit a, to a lighter happy mm -hmm. topic do or people about, tend to get offended by that or do they feel um, like okay I'll, it's okay you just you, you just, just go on. there just you just have to do it yeah and and you're being very honest with them I just don't feel comfortable with that topic. And make sure your tone is respectful and yes, calm. Yes, tone is everything. Don't tone you think? is everything. It so is. So if you say, I just don't like to talk about politics, no, you're going to have a big fight. But just yeah. thanks, Uncle but John, for politely. asking me about that. But I'd, I'd really hmm. like to. That's a good um, tip. I just don't feel comfortable about that That's topic. That's a really, really good tip. Or, or tell them about the, the book that you wrote. You also you just say read. we should plan activities. Interesting yes. one. Yes. Downtime can make it challenging for difficult challenging people stuff comes up when people stuff aren't comes up busy if they're, right? if they're bored or they're just hanging around yeah so just make sure you have plenty of activities maybe you're gonna play board games or charades or decorate cookies or even better if you can get people outside you know maybe you're gonna do a snowman contest I was gonna say you talk hard but maybe you make maybe you make fun out of the snow like maybe exactly. you bundle up and I'll be as a family exactly do something out there so that is true when you're busy you're not thinking about little fights to pick or yes yeah yes. I get that and then makes things happier okay what's the next one fun things next one is oh this is very important plan on an arrival time and an exit time oh this is be genius very now. specific <laughs> now, whether you are hosting or whether you're going to somewhere else okay make sure you're very clear and let them know hey I, I want to come to your we want to um, travel to your house for the holidays I know you guys are going to be hosting is it okay if we come in on such and such a date and when we'll be leaving mm -hmm. does that work for you mm -hmm. and if not we're happy to adjust. lay it out there yes or if you're hosting let's say you're doing the the, the uh, the Christmas Eve. We all have that relative who shows up like a half an hour early every time without fail. Yes, or and it's so hard. If you just keep it open, <laughs> they may stay forever. You yeah. never know. Yeah. So just make it clear, like on the the Christmas Eve, you're doing the Christmas Eve event. Say, so, uh, send a text or an email out to everybody. I'd like everyone to show up at 4:30. We're going to do our family white elephant gift exchange. We'll have dinner and then we will uh, watch our. Our traditional movie of the so family. So next, stone. you say plan your responses, which we've talked about a bit, and I want to get to our last one because it's my favorite one okay. of all. Yes. Plan on giving yourself an important job. This is one I never thought of. Okay. Yes. If you want to be able to have a really good exit for different, you know, <laughs> difficult situations, make yourself the family photographer, or maybe you're the one who's going to be setting the Christmas table, or you're going to be going to the grocery store for those last-minute food items. Yes. And so, if you're in an awkward situation, say, you know what, I, I've got to, I've got to take off. This is my got, job. This, this is, is my, my job. I've got to go get those pictures of the nieces and nephews. Yes, that's genius. Yes. And then that's something people and will value because they'll course. look back on it later on and, and they can't understand. fault you for that. Exactly. So many great tips. We're yes. going to post them all in depth as Perfect. well on our website so if people need a reference um, valbaldwin.com also is where you can go to follow more of what Val's doing and all yeah. of her great tips we appreciate you coming today of course Merry it's Christmas. all about love happy holiday season to you yes appreciate and to you, you coming too. thank you all right up next everyone two quick recipes in the kitchen so it's a double whammy we're making granola but also salad dressing thanks